guys, welcome back. Uh, episode 33 we we're up to. Um, we are playing pretty well. We had the small blip at the beginning um, where we lost <laughs> our opening two games. But since then we've been on a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 game winning streak. And we are scoring freely. We are dominating the Champions League, which is excellent. Super duper happy about that. And in the Premier League, we've had some really, really good wins recently, smashing 11 goals in our last two games. We are six at the moment. Um, Man United are going ahead, running ahead. Those two losses could hurt us, but we are scoring uh, freely, which is good. And uh, we also picked up the Super Cup, which was a nice cheeky little trophy. Um, <coughs> squad looks good. I'm really liking how it's coming together. Um... Rooney got a double against Wednesday. That's good. We got Leeds today. Um, I think I'm going to run like this. Uh, as is, no changes. Let's just have a look. There, yeah, we got ten days to Forest, or and then Milan. Right, let's get into it. Okay, against Leeds. Uh, Leeds are. I think they're struggling. Yeah, they're in eighteenth. Um. I don't know, David Wright, I've never heard of him actually. Still got Radaby, Hart, Kuehl, Fowler, Viduka. Signed Matt Janssen as well, he's pretty decent on this actually. Anyway, and we've got Ibrahimovic getting us off the mark in the 30th minute, which is good. Um, yeah, we're... Those those signings we've brought in have just been so so key, especially when you look at the fact that like Cambiasso, Van der Vaart, Lee Bowyer, and Torres all came in on a free, is just uh, incredible. Finally, he's got a shin injury. I'll get him off, and I think Van der Vaart looks to be no, he's just tired. He is just tired. Uh, Lee Young Po. Looks like he's got an injury. It's got a foot injury. Let's get him off for Hargreaves. And it was Farnerud can come off for Mark Kerr. You know you've got a good team when Mark Kerr can't get a starting berth. Um, but we've got a lot of games to play this season. Um, so the players will get... Yeah, Nico Ferenko. The players will get, you know, Ambo, yeah, against his old club. We'll get some decent game time regardless. And there you go, 4-0. As we just dominating. Look at this. Leeds have just got nothing. They have just absolutely skinned him here. Which is sad for me, uh, being a Leeds supporter. But anyway, <coughs> push on. Um, that's fifth. All right, Oof. broken leg, Mark Schwarzer, ouch. Uh, all right, we have got Nottingham Forest coming up. We will probably look, uh, they're 10th, they're not doing too bad. Make a few little tweaks there, I think. A couple of changes coming in, uh, and then we'll, because uh, then we'll have to hit up Milan. Blackburn, Benfica, Derby, Crystal Palace in the League Cup. Ugh, so many, so many games. So, so many. Ten days in between these now. It gives a nice little rest, actually. Ooh, Savioli would be a top, top signing. Let's add him to the shortlist since we are... We're super cashed up as well. No, we're not super cashed up, but we've got money. I did spend uh, almost 20 million on Frey, but... Um, I th definitely, definitely worth it. Um, as far as I'm concerned, he's made a massive difference. I feel, I think. It's better than Chiotis was. <sighs> and I think Langfield's good there as a backup. Um, Stuart Thorogood did mention, or oh, David Day, who I did. David Day. Uh, who I was looking at as well, uh, but he's moved, um, and he's 30, so I probably, oh, probably will pass on him, actually. Um, 
I mean, let's just do some more random clicking. Langford did win me the Champions League. He's only 24. He's got a long way to go. Um, and he's happy as a squad rotation. So I think I'll leave him as is. We've got internationals. That's why we're, we don't have a game this weekend. So I wonder how we all went. Uh, Whitby and Duff, Gravison, Kafarenko, Hasmanovic, Langford and Kerr, Zlatan, Farnerud and Kennedy, Bakaloglu and Agb Agbabasan still down in the reserves. Transfer listed. Uh, amazingly, we don't have anyone in um, the English. Oh, Lebo's in the English squad as well, I forget. Uh, and they play on the 13th of October. In Slovakia, we don't have a game. We've only got the one game. Anyway, um, we still got a few days. I'll pause it and shoot through this. All right, back for the Forest game. Uh, everyone looks good, although Van der Vaart and Farnerud and Ibrahimovic are definitely getting a rest. So Farnerud, Rafa, and Ibrahimovic. Uh, Anelka. Let's let's give Fernando, and we'll get Anelka on the bench, not in the midfield. Um, Mark Kerr and almost had Fernando Torres playing in the midfield there. That would have been a mistake. Um, let's give victory a turn out here. Um, Hardgreaves, uh, Gravison. Put right Phillips and can be so on the bench. Cool, cool. Against Forest. Anyone stands out there? Mark her, boom. Seven minutes. Like I said, you, you know your team's good when a player like this cannot get in the starting lineup. Yet still plays. He's played four games, I guess, starting. It still plays like amazingly. It's his continental form that's actually let him down. If it wasn't for that, he'd be over an eight. Because last season was quite poor. But anyway, back to the game. So this will be good. This will push us up in the third. Game in hand over United. Uh, I wonder if they're playing at the moment. They are. And they are actually losing to Crystal Palace. Get in, Jamie Victory. Damn it. Forrest pull one back. Oh, Mike Duff. The left and the right back are getting in on the action. Uh, everyone looks good. Lee Bowyer has got a foot injury. Let's get him off for Bacaloglu. And he's on a yellow card. Get in. There's another one for is that Fernando Torres getting his first goal of his Man City career underway, and we just like we're just scoring so freely at the moment. I'm really liking it. Um, yeah, Torres got a shin injury. Mark is all good. Jamie Victory no and Duffy. Let's get a Nelka on for Torres. That shin injury. Uh, other than that, Bonera on for Hargreaves, and do a little swap with Saeed there. It's because he's on that yellow. Get him back a log loop. Palace are pulled back ahead of uh, United are pulled ahead of Palace. Um, Thirty-one goals that we've scored so far. We are just ripping it up there. Um, another great victory. Another massive haul of goals. Um, I have a look at our last couple of games: four-nil Everton, four-nil Feyenoord, 
5-1 Sunderland. All right, the Milan game was a bit close. 6-3 Sheffield Wednesday. 4-0, 5-1. Oh, we score goals like nobody's business. All right, we got Milan. This should be a good one. And I think if we win this, 12 points. Um, that puts us with two games to go. Depends what Benfica do. If they beat Feyenoord, they'll go to six points with two games to go. They can still beat us, but we would, in theory, I think, qualify. All right, that's on Wednesday. So let's go Cambiasso back in there. Liam Pro back out there. Good, good, good. Uh, Ibrahimovic. Torres can go to the bench. Uh, Gravison wasn't so good. Let's get Van der Vaart. And uh, swap Bowie with Kerr. Kerr was really good. Bakaloglu was good. Everyone just plays good. That's the problem. So hard to keep the. Uh, I mean, I was saying, you know, Mark Kerr wasn't playing that well to stay in the team, but he's. He's playing well, so. Um, I can't. Oh, we've also drawn Corinthians in the um, Intercontinental Cup, which I believe is the winner of the Super Cup, and then the American something or rather. Oh, God, that is so bad. I can't remember what it is. Winner of. Anyway. Uh, yeah, they want Corinthians won it last year, so that'll be an interesting trophy to win. And then I think, because don't we, if we won the Champions League, do we get to play in like the World Cup club, the, not the obviously the World Cup, but the World Cup club challenge thing, which I think is at the beginning of the season, so that would be a nice little... Um, pre-season competition for us. Um, I mean, all that's really missing is an FA Cup and a league uh, at the moment, but... Well, if we wrapped up the Intercontinental Cup and those FA Cup and the league in this season, that would be a uh, absolutely astronomical rise uh, yep alright good everyone was happy we're all 100% I'm good with that Farnerud. um he got a 9 he got a 9 and I'm not going to be able to play him somehow because oh yeah His morale's low. Right. But he's going to miss out. Low morale. <coughs> um, so, once again, super important here. We actually want, I guess, Ben Feyenoord to beat Benfica or even draw with them, I guess. Beating them would be better because that would put them on four. And uh, we beat Milan with except Shevchenko scores there. So, uh, with his first shot on target after we've had five and <coughs> super captain goes down um can't diss down on because he's left footed although it's okoronko he's either footed we'll go for diss down it's half time mm, not looking good not not a great start especially when we've had so many chances and they and someone's just copped a red card. Far out, this Dan. You absolute bloody plonker. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm sorry, Kerr. And Torres and for Ibrahimovic as well. Hmm. There's me being oh Van der Bart's pulled one back just before Distan gets sent off, so that's good. Uh, hopefully we can nab another one. I mean, we should do with 
bit of shot we're having. It's going to be a draw. Mm. That's a bit disappointing. I feel we should have got more out of that. What happened in the other game? Benfica. They drew, I think. Let's Yep, they drew one all. So, um, yeah. Okay, we're not quite qualified yet. That's all right. Ten days for Saeed. I uh, can't discipline Distan because he won't understand why. Oh, I got a... Um, where was it? Oh, the regular con contributor Stuart Thorogood, who I mentioned before, he did mention a, uh, a couple of players, obviously one with da David Day, Dia, um, but the other one was old uh, Ali Karimi, the Iranian, maybe if I get the last I in there. Do you know him? He is pretty decent. Um, not on this one. He's not. No. Sorry, Stuart. Not with those stats. Uh, I think. Oh, Shannon sent me that three. I think when Stuart plays on the with the was it Lusen Lussendorf update, so it changes some of those. Um, Changes some of that potential, so that they're a bit uh, a bit better. That's all good. Um, we'll probably have to rest a couple of players, I reckon, for this Blackburn game. Saeed's out anyway, so that's a that's a blow. That's right. It's only ten days. Only ten. We've got the uh, squad to, to cover it. So Saeed's out. I'm going to play um, 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 uh, Bonera. West can go to the bench. And I'll swap Bonera and Okoronkwo. Uh, other than that, Van der Vaart and Fadner Rudd. Um... Farnerad and be Gravison. I'm gonna start Anelka for this one. Oh, Rep Billy. Oh no, Mark Kerr's good. It was Vandervaart, wasn't it? Um, yep. All right. Let's roll with that. Lee Bowyer, captain. Isley, oh, I can't roll with it. Isley Bowyer, your captain? Oh, he's got 17. Sure. Kick off against Blackburn. They got anyone? David Dunn, obviously. Dwight York still. Marcus Ben. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lee Sahar, Dirk Kite. And they score. <laughs> Marcus Bent, first shot. Getting a bit sick of that, actually. Come on, Frey. I just bigged you up because you're playing well. And now you're pulling this rubbish out where you're letting in one shot. The first shot of the last two games. Did it against Milan as well. And bloody Marcus Ben. I mean, he's quite good on this, but anyway. Come on. Oh, come on. There's me giving it all that, saying, oh, we're so good. We just romp games now with so many goals, and now we're just fucking crap. Oh, this is our first loss in a long, long time, though, and is actually going to dent our title bid quite a bit. Okoronkwo getting one back. Not Mark 
Uh, fine. You're not overly concerned because I do know that we can score goals um, quite well. Sorry, Nick. You haven't scored. Sure, he's going to get peed off at that. Take Bacaloglu off as well. And put right Phillips in there. Ugh. Four shots. Frey is having a mare. Young Pro is taking my penalties, but anyway. Oh, we've equalised. What an absolute brilliant comeback. And uh, that's good, I guess. Uh, what did Frey end up on? A six. Um, just want to check penalty takers here. Fano had one. Bacaloglu three. Who the hell's two? Um. Oh, Saeed two. Yep, three Bakaloglu, four Hasmanovic. That's Eva. I oh, yep. Torres fifteen. Torres is probably slightly better than Anelka. Five, six, seven. Alright, uh, Adelaide. Uh, available only. Don't include reserves. Alright. Oh, uh, we've got Benfica. And distance suspended. So, um, right Phillips there. And dun 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 dun. Back a log glue. What bow do you do? And a Bowyer and Kerbu last game. Uh, Mark Kerr out for Fineroad. And Fineroad will swap for Bowyer. Mark Kerr down to the bench. Shh, shh, shh. Cool. Oh, I'll probably get Benfica and Derby in to round out the month, I reckon. If we can, all right, we're at Man United one, oh, seven points behind them with a game in hand. We've got to win that game in hand. Point against Blackburn was quite vital in the end. We have shipped thirteen goals. Um, <coughs> it could be, it could be a combination of a a newish team and um, you know, Husey, Quasi, um. And Frey's first season in the Premier League, so. We'll see how we go. I mean, I'm not going to change goalkeepers again, because I don't think I can get too much better <laughs> than Sebastian Frey. Oh, ha, ha. All right, we're all good. Benfica. I think a point here. And we're good. Even if Milan beat Feyenoord, 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 they'll go to eight. <coughs> um, we should still get through on goal difference at the top of the group. Bowie goes down. Let's get Mark Kerr on. End of our captain. Sure, they lost Nuno Gomez. Benfica. Yep, Simao. Yep, get in. Ibrahimovic. Nicky Ferenko then. Making it two. Oh, and Cambiasso is injured. Not good. Got a couple of other players that are looking a bit tired as well. Benfica running us ragged, or we're running ourselves ragged with 11 shots on target in the first half. <coughs> and this is good. Um, no, we look to be alright. Let's 
Let's have a look, see if anyone else is looking like they need a rest. And about no Shana he's probably just a bit tired as well. Coronquo's on a yellow. Let's get him off for Teribo. So we don't lose a player. Lose him. Get in Farnard. And that is gonna be a great victory. Benfica have not even had a shot on target yet. Frey having a quiet day at the back, which is good. Be a nice clean sheet, hopefully. Good stuff. Nikiforenko, since being moved up into play behind that hole, he has played excellently. As you can see, f the second half of last season is where I moved him as well, and he improved there. Uh, good, so that means we qualify top of the group, along with Milan, Benfica, Feyenoord, can you say Feyenoord, um, are out. Um, do, 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 where is he? Brett Emerton, keep an eye on him. Ten days, two weeks. That's a shame. Um, <clears throat> that's a shame. We can rest everyone for that last game against Feyenoord. Um, what are we up to? 26. All right. Um, you yeah guys, we're going to leave it there. Um, good episode, apart from that draw against Blackburn, other than that, um, scored a lot of goals, had some cracking wins, climbing the ladder slowly, um, and qualified for the second phase of the Champions League, Champions League. Anyway guys, please leave a like, don't forget to comment, and uh, please do subscribe, and I will catch you next time, bye.